Chief is a family-owned, Nebraska-based company comprised of seven diverse brands. Chief, trusted, tested, true. Good morning, everyone. Um, so a little bit different of a video. I'm going to try this out. Grant and I used to do this a lot um, when I first started filming YouTube videos, like in the very beginning years. Um, I would show you a lot of the stuff that Grant and I did off the farm. And it's Labor Day weekend. And I know there's a tractor behind me, but we are not going to be doing any farming today. We are up in Wyoming and we are going to be riding around on razors and rangers. And I think we have some dirt bikes with us today in uh, Medicine Bow National Forest. There is the most gorgeous trails up here. You can hear the dirt bike ripping around. There's the most gorgeous trails up here and the weather is perfect. It rained last night, so the trails are not going to be dusty. Um, and it's still green. The leaves aren't changing for fall yet, but I have a feeling in any day now, they're gonna start turning yellow and orange and red. Um, but we are going to be enjoying some time with some company. It's really funny because we have to drive all these hours into Wyoming to hang out with people that live like 30 minutes from us, which I think is kind of fun. But anytime we come up here, we always see somebody we know from home on the trails. So come with Grant and I today as we hit the trails and take you guys with us. The machines coming with us, we got a couple Ranger XP1000s. We got a Pro R over there. There's our machine, a dirt bike, a little Razor 200, like some Can Ams. We have, Another... a, we have some Can Ams with us today, which I feel like we never ride with Can Ams. We're usually like strictly Polaris people through and through. So I'm kind of excited to see how those do on the trail. They're so long. It's crazy. We even have a doggo. This Poppy. is Risky Jack. <laughs> got a big crew today. Let's go have some fun. All this is going to be covered in snow pretty soon. <laughs> I know that maybe side-by-side -side riding slash driving isn't for everyone, but Grant and I like just truly have so much fun doing this. We really have a blast. I feel like farming is just such like a high stress thing. Like, I guess me personally, I always feel like the water is up to here and I'm just like keeping my head barely above water trying to breathe. And doing something like this, that's super high speed, adrenaline inducing. I like the farming, I can't even think about it. Yeah, and like it just is, thank, it's, it's like relaxing to me. Thank goodness Gage, our high school hired man is back irrigating. So in the comments, thank Gage, he's the man. He's the one who makes us be able to do this. I know. I know we kind of give him a little bit of a hard time because we really only film him when he gets stuck or gets in a tight spot. But Gage, we've had him, oh my gosh, it's almost been a year. Almost been a year. It's now. almost been a year that we've had Gage and he, he He's has just become like an integral part of our team. He's and so, and like. So when we're all three on the farm, it's a bit much like definitely don't need all three of us there but we do make a good team though i feel like the three yeah. of us have a really good fun like time together in the we're shop like we always have to do go to farm shows or lower farms things like it's nice to have three people yeah gage does a great job our well this is not a polaris ad like the the ranger thing like that was definitely polaris sanctioned or whatever but this thing is awesome let's do, give me give us a little walk around grant so the machine we had a 2021 XP 1000 like base model like we were just getting into it and like that thing was awesome and then I was of course on Facebook marketplace I found this thing with all the accessories on it and like way under price from a new one I was like oh yeah let's get this one and it's got like upgraded suspension windshield cab and man it is just like it is awesome out here and they have this ride command thing like 
The downside is it's very loud, so we wear headsets in here to protect our hearing. But, I mean, this thing is just a blast. We just have a really fun time. And, like, the machine is fun by itself, but the best part is, well, I guess there's two best parts. One is the places we go. I mean, are you kidding me? There's no cell phone service, which especially now doing all the Laura Farms things that I do, I appreciate having no service and not being able to text or email. Like that is true relaxation for me. Um, but then, you know, we get to enjoy beautiful views and wildlife and see these beautiful creek crossings and trees. Um, but then also the people we go on these trips with really just make it. Um, we've made some really good friends who also have side by sides and being able to spend time with them and do this like just really fun activity. I don't know. I hope Grant and I can translate through the camera how much fun we have doing stuff like It this. is amazing how much fun you can have on eight gallons of gas in a day. It's nuts. Like, we're just out here having a blast and mm -hmm. the scenery is just... It does not get much better. Awesome time on the razor trip, uh, but I wanted to quick stick with the theme of kind of off the farm stuff. You guys asked in the comments and in my direct messages, Bunker Brandy and I listened. We are now offering sweatshirts, these hoodies here. I'm wearing a size small. Grant wears a size extra large. This is the design on the back, and this is what's on the front. We're offering these as well as some thicker jackets for winter time. These go live today and there's a limited supply, so get them quickly while you can because they will not be around forever. You can find those under this video right here or by going to bunkerbranding.com. After the razor trip, we got home, worked on some stuff, and then we also wanted to share with you an evening from about a week later. Good morning, everybody, or rather good evening. A little bit of a different start to the video because I know you guys like when Grant and I share some of the things we do in the evenings for fun or just some of the off the farm activities. And we are in the geo tracker tonight. Finally, it's, we got the geo out. It's been a long time since we ha we've had a geo tracker date. And uh, we're hanging out with Gage out here and some of our friends. And um, we don't just always put him to work. We do have fun with him sometimes too. Oh, here he is. I just wanted to share with you guys how incredibly peaceful it is out here because I know a lot of people don't get to experience things like this. I am not saying that every single day in Nebraska is like the crazy best time. There are definitely windy, like weird weather days um, and it's really flat here. I but mean, look at this. but look at this. these are evenings that we just truly are so grateful to be from Nebraska. I mean, this is just gorgeous. And I really wanted to share this with you guys.
people litter like none other off the bridges. And so while we're out here, we're like on a little rescue mission, cleaning up the rivers and picking up trash because it's look, ridiculous. Right All right, go pick that up. Just a little river cleanup crew. I'll get that one, I'll get this one up here. Sounds good. You might be wondering why the river is so dry. It happens every single year. The snow melt in Wyoming has slowed down, but just give it a couple weeks and it'll start snowing there again and the river will be flowing once again. It is just the most peaceful place to spend an evening. We love the river.